and welcome to today's video. So in this video, I'm going to share cat memes and also spill some tea about medical school. Let's start. Roses are red, violets are blue. Rhyming is hard, like I am for you. My parents watch every single video of mine, so I definitely don't understand what does that mean. Moving on to the tea for medical school. Actually, it's just me answering questions, <laughs> but since I think tea is something more interesting for people, I say tea. On a scale of 1 to 10, how hard is medical school? Let's see. Honestly, if we are talking about syllabus, it is a 7. It's not that easy, obviously. Thank you, Captain Obvious. But it's not that hard either. It's doable if you have passion for it. If you don't have passion for it, change your course. Um, surroundings wise, for me, it's a 10 out of 10 because if you're not a people person and you go to medicine, it's like digging your own grave because you have to work with people. If you're not a people person, at the end of every day, you will feel very drained. Like your social battery just goes, let's move on to another meme. And let's give a big warm welcome to sadness. Isn't this like everyone? I think everyone in this app is sad. We all relate to that, Salem. Next question, aka T to spill. Menyesal tak masuk medical school? Hmm. <laughs> of course tak menyesal. Ya Allah, kalau menyesal macam mana nak buat YouTube video pasal medical school? Macam mana nak upload gambar pakai stethoscope, laptop putih, masuk ke Instagram? Confirm lah tak menyesal. <laughs> Stress apa tu? Masya Allah, sikit pun tak ada stress. Next cat meme. Patate. I don't know if I'm doing meme reviews the right way. But I always watch PewDiePie. He's funny, I'm not. So there's that. Which stethoscope series apa you guna? Um, Lead Man Series 2, Special Edition. If you're a medical student, it doesn't matter what type or what brand of, of stethoscopes you use. As long as it is usable, you can listen to what you're supposed to listen to. Those are good. Um, some of the brands that I see people use are Litman, Spirit. Huh, just that, Litman and Spirit. <laughs> Let's move on to the next cat meme. I'm doing this terribly. <laughs> it says here, oh, it's still the black cat. You're a, the B word. If we call someone son of a... Are we just actually calling them puppies? I don't know how to review this. Why am I doing this to myself? Subhanallah. Next question. How do you survive Pete's posting? Since you dislike children. Let me let me get things straight. I don't dislike children, but I don't particularly like them. As in like if I see kids uh, or babies, I wouldn't miss them. Oh my god, it's a baby. I want to hold it. I wouldn't like go like that. I'll just be like, ah, a child. Okay. Maybe all my motherhood instincts go to cats. So how do I survive this is by the ABCDE of pediatrics. Arrive, blow bubbles. But sometimes my lecturers don't like bubbles. Sometimes the bubbles like pop and go to the children's eyes, which can be really dangerous. So arrive, blow pretentious bubbles. Calming noises. Like cuckoo cuckoo, oh the shine, oh shine, oh the shine, oh the shine, oh the bite, oh the chomel, oh the good boy. And in brackets, baby shark, do do do. I actually did this. I hated it, but I had to. So and e everything else. As in, um, you know the usual examination. That's how I survive beats. Cat memes. It's a sad white cat with my favorite drink. Bleach! Just kidding. Don't drink bleach. Do you know that Tesco bleach and also Tesco yogurt drink have the same packaging? Dangerous. Nama pendek din. Nama panjang dangerous. I am very annoying. Any tips to survive clinical years? Um, number one, repetition. Number two, practice. Number three, have a support system. There will be days when you fail stuff. Failure is like a new friend made in college that you didn't want. You need a support system to, to like, you know, to lift you up, 
and to tell you that it's fine it's part of the process next cat beam what's that to review about this meme it's just a sad cat looking at a phone screen okay la, let me just make up some words for it when you expect a reply but the reply does not arrive or maybe when you want to order food panda but all the restaurants are closed next question does any of your friends slash colleague get depression from the pressure of medical school wow what a serious question so to answer this question mm, yes of course but i think ah she i think je nanti kena marah my lecturers hate it when I, when we use i think this patient has cannot cannot you must know what the disease is if you don't know go study uh, so i don't think <laughs> mostly what i have heard is they get burnout either physical burnouts or mental burnouts you know they spend day to day talking to patients day to day studying day to day getting scolded sometimes it just gets too much it takes a toll on everything and they just collapse but in my opinion che dah tak pakai i think dah kan <laughs> actually opinions also cannot but since this is my video i am going to use my opinion in my opinion doctors have this worse compared to medical students like yes medical students do um, get it bad but doctors get it worse when you're a student you do something wrong People are just gonna say, ah, it's okay. You're a student. You're still learning. Of course, you will get scolded. Like, I'm the lah buat benda salah. Tak belajar ke? But people are still gonna say, like, oh, it's okay. You're still learning. But when you're a doctor, you're expected to do everything cleanly. Of course, a doctor is not supposed to make any mistakes because we are dealing with people's lives. I understand that. But doctors are humans too. So they get way worse burnouts emotional mental and physical compared to us students so if you have any doctors if you know any of them say thank you for your service and if you see them you know spilling their emotions on social media let them be if anyone at all spill their emotions on social media let them be if you don't like it mute it ah itu pun nak kena ajar curse next cat meme i wish i can find better memes that are not sad and they like happy memes Oh, there! Oh, look! It's us before an exam. <laughs> I remember before my SPM, I went to the surau for like I don't know ten times per day. Ya Allah, such a fake. Hamba Allah. Cuma malu sikit. Next question. Should I go for medical course? My answer would be if you are in this for the money, no. The workload is not worth the salary if you're in it for the passion go for it if you think the passion can be lit for as long as possible for me i went to medical school because since i was 7 i've always wanted to be a doctor and i call that brainwashing <laughs> that's the only occupation i can think of when i was 7 that i wanted to do so if we can teach the younger generation that there are so many other occupations out there we should do so <laughs> doctors lawyers engineers architects you know these are not the only occupations in the world god damn it <laughs> disclaimer number 1 i'm not the only medical student in malaysia number 2 not entirely everything that i say is accurate but at least to me they are number 3 i apologize for any sayings that I have said wrongly in this video. That's basically it for this video. See you guys next Saturday. Bye.